Welcome to Two Projects. In this video, we are going to see English language accent classification and conversion using machine learning. Introduction. The project explores English language accent classification conversion using advanced machine learning algorithms. It uses convolutional neural networks and long short term memory networks to predict accents from audio files and potentially convert them using CycleGAN. This project provides insights into cross accent communication and the potential for accent transformation in the evolving linguistic landscape. Object of the project In order to categorize and convert English accents using machine learning, this project will use deep learning techniques specifically CNN and RNN. The project aims to accurately classify English accents by extracting MFCC features from audio files and training a model with CNN and LSTN. The project also aims to implement CycleGAN to change accents from sources to targets. The goal of the project is to improve inter accent communication and demonstrate the potential of accent conversion. Requirements These are the requirements needed to execute this project Hardware requirements Operating system of Windows, processor of i5 and above, RAM of 4GB and above, hard disk of 20GB and above. Software requirements needed are Python IDLU Python 3.7 version. To execute this project, we have designed the following modules. The first module is Upload English Language Dataset. In this module, the user can upload a dataset containing audio files with different English accents. These audio files serve as the basis for training and testing the machine learning models. The second module is Pre Process Dataset. This module involves reading the audio files from the uploaded dataset, extracting MEL frequency substral coefficients MFCC features from the audio files. MFCCs are widely used for speech and audio processing, representing the spectral characteristics of the audio signals. And this module also involves splitting the extracted MFCC features into training and testing sets. Typically, an 80 is to split. 80 to 20 split is used where 80% of the data is used for training and 20% for testing. The third module is Train CNN plus LSTM model. In this module, the project employs convolutional neural networks and long short term memory networks. CNNs are effective at capturing spatial patterns in data, making them suitable for image and audio analysis. In this context, CNNs analyze the extracted MFCC features to learn accent-specific patterns. And LSTM networks are a type of recurrent neural network that excel at capturing sequential dependencies in data. They are well suited for time series and sequence data like speech signals. The MFCC features serve as input to the combined CNN and LSTM model. The model learns to differentiate between various English accents during the training phase. The next module is Accent Classification and Conversion. This module applies the trained CNN and LSTM model to predict the accent of a given test audio file. By analyzing the extracted MFCC features, the model determines the most likely accent category for the input audio. Additionally, the project explores accent conversion using the CycleGAN algorithm. The last module is CNN Accuracy and Loss Graph. This module aims to visualize the training process of the CNN part of the model. It plots the accuracy and loss values over training iterations or reports. This graph provides insights into how well the model is learning and whether it's overfitting or underfitting the training data. Execution of the project to execute the project, first we need to open the code folder which contains the project source code files. So this is the dataset folder in which I have three different languages dataset English, Hindi and Spanish. So I'm opening the English folder. So these are the English audio files I have. So similarly we have respective languages audio files in other two folders also. We will train the models using these audio files. So this is the model folder in which I have pickle, numpy and .htf5 files which contain algorithm information. These files will be loaded into the project code during runtime to utilize the trained models. This is the test audio file in which I have these audio files on which we will perform accent classification conversion using the trained models. 
these are the python main code files and this is the run.bat file instead of executing the program through command line interface we have created windows bat file to execute the project now double click on run.bat file this graphical user interface will be opened with this when interacting with the program we have used tikinter library to create this graphical user interface now click on upload english accent dataset button a dialog box opens select the dataset and click on select folder so in the text area we can see a confirmation that dataset is loaded and we can see types of accents found in dataset are english hindi and spanish now click on preprocess dataset button so we can see after mfcc the extracted features are 850 now click on train cnn plus lstm model button So this is the CNN plus LSTM confusion matrix graph. So in this graph, on x-axis I have the predicted class, and on y-axis I have true class. So these diagonal boxes are the correct classifications, and the remaining boxes are the misclassifications. And we can see there are very few misclassifications. That means our model is doing well. Close this graph, and in the text area we can see accuracy, precision, recall, and f-score of the model. Now click on accent classification conversion button. A dialog box opens. These are the test audios I have. Select any of these audios. I'm selecting the first one, and click on Open. So in the text area, we can see the uploaded audio is classified as English accent. Now again, click on Accent Classification Conversion button. This time, we'll select sixth audio and click on Open. So here we can see. The uploaded audio is classified as English. Now click on CNN Accuracy and Loss Graph button. So in this graph, on x-axis I have iterations or epochs, and on y-axis I have accuracy and loss. And we can see for every increasing epoch, accuracy is also increasing, and for every increasing epoch, loss is decreasing. That means our model is doing well. Close this graph, and the conclusion here is. Utilizing CNN and LSTM, this project employed deep learning for English accent classification and conversion. Extracting MFCC features and training on the speech accent achieved dataset ensured accurate accent classification. Highlighting cross accent communications potential in language processing, the project also adapted a GTSS APT cycle gan model due to execution challenges. This alternative approach successfully converted English source accents to converted dot mp3 files showcasing innovative problem solving within the studies framework thank you for watching this video thank you for watching video for more projects please visit our website www.trueprojects.in for updates on latest project videos please visit true projects youtube channel and subscribe